they are naked, shamelessly naked. The Lord's caution to such nominal churches who are claiming to be Bible churches, some of which are claiming to be Pentecostal churches, some of which are claiming to be evangelistic, evangelical churches, some of which are even claiming to be holiness churches, is to depend. I'm excited to welcome you to Tunde Fumi YouTube channel. We ask that you please subscribe to our channel for inspirational songs, powerful messages, and content that will bless you. Please do subscribe and you will never remain the same again. God bless you. What are the characteristics we see that the Lord pointed out in this scripture? Look at that in that verse 17, Revelation chapter 3, verse 17. Because thou said, I am rich. What we see about these people, they said, I am rich. Financial prosperity, but spiritual poverty. Financial prosperity, but spiritual poverty. Number two, look at what it says there. An increase with goods. Material riches. More impoverished. They are materially enriched, but they are morally impoverished. Their moral life go down and down, more decay and decay. Number three, look at that verse. It says, and I have need of nothing. They say they have need of nothing. When you have a church who says, we have all the truth here. It is here that you have all the truth. That's self-deception. There are churches deceiving themselves. We are Bible churches. We have all the truth. Who told you so? That you have all the truth. Look at it. They said they have need of nothing. That is self-satisfaction without sanctification. Self-satisfaction without sanctification. Look at the next thing it says. They said, and know it not. They know not. They may have head knowledge, but they have spiritual ignorance. Head knowledge, but spiritual ignorance. And know it not, it says, that that wretched, wretched, these people in these nominal churches, wretched, Despite their physical height in life, despite their great height in life, they are spiritual malnourishment. They are spiritually malnourished. They are not balanced in the scripture. They only know as far as what their pastor teaches them. They don't know anything more. Number six, it says, miserable. This nominal church, miserable. Despite their media app, they have a lot of media app online on social media, they have it on the internet, they have it on radio and television, they have media app, but they have spiritual misery. Spiritual misery. Look at the next word it says they're poor. They are poor. These people, despite their professional proficient, they claim they have this academic qualification and certification, professional proficient, yet they have damning spiritual malady. Damning spiritual malady. Number eight, look at it, it says, blind, they are blind. This nominal church, they have book knowledge, but they lack revelational knowledge of the truth. They have book knowledge, but they lack revelational knowledge of the truth. Number seven, it says, that naked they have modern dressing in their church but there is no modesty in their church they have extravagant makeup and dresses in their church there is no moderation in their life they now wear worldly attires with all sorts of perforations and holes all around nets all over their body but they have no proper covering they are naked shamelessly naked the lord's caution to such nominal churches who are claiming to be bible churches some of which are claiming to be pentecostal churches 
some of which are claiming to be evangelista, evangelical churches, some of which are even claiming to be holiness churches, is to depend.